Over 100 people applied to be the next CEO for the Youngstown City Schools. This morning, the job was offered to a person who applied from Michigan. First News Senior Reporter Jerry Ricciuti has the details in our top story. Incoming Youngstown School CEO Justin Jennings tells me his specialty is turning around programs. And as I look through it, at the situation, the job just seemed to be the right fit. Right enough that members of the State Academic Distress Commission overseeing the district chose Jennings to succeed Krish Mohip, who's stepping down this summer after three years on the job. I've been a special ed director, I've been assistant superintendent over curriculum, I've been a classroom teacher and administrator. The 44-year-old brings 19 years of experience in the Michigan schools, working now as superintendent of the Muskegon District and holds three master's degrees and is working on his doctorate. He served on the Michigan Principals Association and was selected to sit on the board of the Michigan High School Athletic Association. He tells me the key to his success will be getting parents and families more involved in their children's education. Our expectation is not for parents to be algebra teachers or teachers of math, but we want them to be able to come and support the scholars and support the school system. Jennings says he's not looking to make sweeping changes right away, stressing he wants to work with the Board of Education and local unions and make improvements where they're needed. When we make those tough decisions, have to make sure that they're able to speak to why we made those decisions. And, and I think that's something that you're going to see in me, and that's something you uh, will see different. Jennings still needs to work out a contract with the Distress Commission and will start officially August 1st, but he intends to spend the next few months transitioning into the new job. Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.